A new study reveals black holes could be the source of dark energy, the mysterious force that drives the universe's expansion, and that they may be growing together with the universe. This groundbreaking discovery could finally reveal what black holes really are. The universe is a vast, mysterious place, filled with secrets and wonders beyond our wildest imagination. And yet, for all that we do know about the cosmos, there is still so much that remains unknown. One of the biggest mysteries of the universe is a strange, elusive force known as dark energy. The idea of dark energy came in the 1990s, when astronomers studying distant supernovae noticed something strange. These exploding stars appeared to be moving away from us faster than they should be, given the known laws of physics. This led scientists to conclude that the expansion of the universe was actually accelerating rather than slowing down. The idea of dark energy actually dates back to the early 20th century, when Albert Einstein first introduced the concept of a cosmological constant. This constant was meant to represent a uniform energy density that fills all of space, counterbalancing the gravitational attraction between matter and the universe and preventing it from collapsing in on itself. However, when the accelerating expansion of the universe was discovered, the cosmological constant was resurrected as a possible explanation for dark energy. In this model, the cosmological constant is thought to be a constant energy density that fills space uniformly and is responsible for the acceleration of the universe's expansion. Dark energy seems to be driving this acceleration. It's invisible, intangible, and incredibly powerful. It's believed that the universe is made up of roughly 5% ordinary matter, 27% dark matter, and 68% dark energy. We have never detected dark energy itself, but we know it exists because of its gravitational effects on ordinary matter. Its origin and nature remain a mystery, but the latest study could change that. A team of 17 international researchers led by the University of Hawaii has found clues that suggest black holes could be the origin of dark energy. According to observations of ancient and dormant galaxies, black holes are growing more than expected, which is consistent with a phenomenon predicted by Einstein's theory of gravity. This finding suggests that there may not be a need to revise our understanding of the universe to account for dark energy, as black holes and Einstein's theory of gravity together may be responsible for it. Black holes acquire mass through two methods, accretion of gas and mergers with other black holes. Accretion occurs when matter, such as gas or dust, is pulled toward the black hole by its immense gravitational force. As this matter gets closer to the black hole, it heats up and emits radiation, which can be observed by telescopes. The gravitational pull of the black hole increases as it accumulates more mass, causing it to pull in matter even more strongly, which in turn leads to further accretion. Also, when two black holes merge, their combined mass is greater than the sum of their individual masses, so they make a more massive black hole. But there seems to be a problem with this. It appears older black holes are significantly larger than expected based on these two methods alone. To see if these effects alone could account for the growth of supermassive black holes, researchers analyzed data spanning 9 billion years. The team focused on a specific type of galaxy known as giant elliptical galaxies that evolved in the early universe and then became dormant. Because these galaxies have already stopped forming stars, there's little material left for the black hole at their center to consume, meaning that their growth can't be explained by normal astrophysical processes such as accretion or mergers with other black holes. By comparing observations of distant young galaxies with those of local older elliptical galaxies, the researchers found that the black holes in the latter were much larger than predicted by accretion or mergers alone. Specifically, these black holes were found to be 7 to 20 times larger than they were 9 billion years ago. This suggests that there must be another source of mass for these black holes. The researchers propose that the missing source of mass may be attributed to the effects of dark energy, which takes the form of vacuum energy and is present in the fabric of space itself.
This energy causes the universe to expand at an accelerating rate and could provide a possible explanation for the observed discrepancies in black hole growth. But the story keeps getting more interesting. When researchers analyzed related populations of galaxies at various points in the universe's evolution, they found that the size of the universe is in good agreement with the mass of black holes. This implies that the amount of dark energy in the universe can be accounted for by black hole vacuum energy. In fact, this is the first observed evidence that black holes contain vacuum energy and that they're coupled to the expansion of the universe, increasing in mass as the universe expands. This phenomenon is referred to as cosmological coupling, and if further observations confirm it, it could significantly reshape our understanding of black holes and their role in the universe's evolution. The discovery of dark energy has had a profound impact on our understanding of the universe. It means that the universe will continue to expand indefinitely rather than eventually collapsing back in on itself. It also raises new questions about the nature of time and space, as well as the possibility of a multiverse. Don't forget to watch the video on the right and subscribe. Thanks for being part of Cosmonology.